Hi guys, it's Liliana the Magnificent and welcome back to my main city, Dukes of Honey. I've had a couple of players reach out to me and ask if I would do a video when I'm actually spending my lanterns from this spring event, and so today is the day. It's the Pagoda upgrade, and I'm going to be getting the upgrade in both my main city here in Brisgard and also in my secondary city in Houndsmore. So we're going to kind of show the difference of the two. So over in this city, I have a couple of more lanterns because I haven't spent any actually at all but if we go into my inventory I do want to show from last year's event I do have actually two pagodas within my stock and I have two upgrades so with this pagoda upgrade I'm gonna need one two three four five six I need six but I have two so I only need four more and I figured let's see how many we can get um, Maybe we'll have a couple of pagodas. <laughs> we'll kind of see, but let's jump right in. And then we'll do it in my other city too. But I did have to purchase some lanterns to get a level one there. So we'll kind of see the difference. Um, so I am going to utilize this FOE helper as we go because it is actually pretty nifty. It does show you that um, this green option here is the cheapest for using the most amount of steps um, to get kind of the bang out of your buck. But then over here it shows you the price of the day so it's actually cheapest to go for this 8% um, and you'll get the most cost effectiveness for choosing that and hopefully getting the prize but for me and this is just going to be honest in this world um, I care more about at this time the steps because I really do want to get um, I think it's the Mikawa. Yeah, it's the Mikawa Bridge. I want to get this one. So that's my main goal. And because I already have two upgrades in my inventory, it's not super important that I get the daily. So we're going to go after the steps in this round. So we're going to go after the ones that give us the most steps for everything. And we'll kind of see what we get with it. All right, next one, it says that the cheapest is still this 151. <clears throat> And we're still going to go with that one, even though that one's the highest. I could go for that. It's not too much of a difference, but to me, it doesn't really matter. We're just going to go for the bigger one. Oh, so there's one upgrade. Now we're going to go with this middle one, which actually ends up being the highest percent, but it's not necessarily the cheapest, but it's pretty close. Um, 10... Let's see. Sorry, guys. I'm also kind of looking at the stats as we go to see which one I do want to do. So let's see. Mass coin. I hardly ever use those, you guys. I really probably should, but I do make a lot of coins in my city regardless. <laughs> oh, more goods. I wish they would do some previous era goods in this because that's what I really need. <laughs> And with this one, this is nice because I don't want to waste extra lanterns to stay outside of this because this is it shows you that this is the end of one round of the pond. So we're going to go with that one. Oh, look at so many of our little silver guys. These are so cute. I love the little graphics of these guys. They're just adorable. All right. Let's see. We're going to keep going. We still only have one upgrade, you guys. So our lanterns are looking pretty good, though. So that's good. Store buildings are always fantastic. We need a 110. Okay, we're at two, you guys. Um, I have a feeling it's going to be a lot of the elephants, but that's okay. The elephants are so cute. That rat, every single time, it just cracks me up. <laughs> I thought it was a tent the first time I saw it. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Um, let's see if we're going to go after the 113. Yeah, this FOE helper is super nice just for a lot of the stats. I am going to have a video about it because it is fantastic, you guys. Just fantastic. I really, really like it. And they keep adding on other kind of details. Like, I, they didn't have this before, but I don't think when I downloaded it, there was a special event, so... <laughs> That swan is cute too. Ooh, 
Ooh, medals. I'm totally after medals all the time. Ooh, yes. Okay, let's see. More cards. Oh, look at that. I only had one gold this time and lots of the cute little... Ooh, yes. 50 forge points. That makes me happy. I love forge points, you guys. Those are still my favorite thing ever to receive. Like, even over sometimes upgrades, I get pretty darn excited about that. Okay, we're going after 110. Ooh, okay. Yeah, we're at three, you guys. I'm actually, like, holding <laughs> the number on my finger so that I don't forget <laughs> what I'm at. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. Okay, those attack boosts, though. I know that was a defender boost, but the attack boosts are fantastic. So, you guys, you can actually use your tavern and do an attack boost tavern, and then you can use those little potions on top of it. Oh, so fantastic, especially for like GBG. Oh, yes, that's where it's at. Oh, God, I love Forge Points. So excited. <laughs> oh. Self aid kit. I used to use those a lot more, but then we switched our guild requirement to having aiding every week. That And that has been huge, you guys. When you have a, a pretty good sized guild and they're all aiding, Oh, your stuff never goes unaided anymore. It's just fantastic. Okay. Ooh, so no, this is a tough one. Oh. We're just going to go for the longer one because I don't want to waste. It would be a waste. It's fine. It would be a waste. Ooh, look at that. Is it a dog? I think it's a dog. I almost thought it was a lion at first. I think it's a cute puppy. <laughs> not paying attention very well. All right, let's see. 110. Oh, we're still only at three. Oh, look at all those medals. That's nice. Another 110. I just love that. Oh, this is so pretty. Okay, sorry. I'm just all about this. I love the graphics of it. It's just so cool. Okay. 110. Oh my god, I'm getting a lot of medals. Now that I said I liked medals, they're like, here, Lil. Have more medals. <laughs> no, there's a reason why I like medals, you guys. I'm like after medals for on that on the medal count, which you can only see on the phone or on the computer, not on your phone. But yeah, it's awesome. That's what I'm after. Uh, store buildings, those are nice. One ten. Oh, more medals. <laughs> oh man. Okay, so we're down to four thousand. Ooh. Ooh, this wasn't a very lucky round. I've held up three the whole time. Okay, um, so this one we're going to go after the 80, which is this little guy here. I think that must have been a lion, because that is definitely a dog. Ooh, color guard. Mmm, yuck. It's okay. It's all right. Shrine of Knowledge. Come on, little froggy. Hop, hop, hop. Get to work. Okay, 113. Elephant. Elephants are lucky. We're going to... I feel like the elephants are very lucky. Okay, mm, 152. Store building. Wish I was getting some reno kits, but I know those were an actual daily prize, so like, yeah, come on, girl. <laughs> You're not gonna get any more of them. <laughs> Ooh, 9,000 medals. Oof. I have to check my medal count after this, you guys. It's like I've gone on a. <laughs> 1.9 thread just in here. All right, let's see. 110. Ooh. We need another pagoda. Okay, let's see. 113. Come on, elephant. You can do it. Darn it. <laughs> okay, fox. Oh, come on. Ooh, okay, swan. Oh, okay, another 9,000. Okay, we... Oh, boy, we're down to 3.3. <laughs> guys. Oh, no. Okay, I'm not going to stress out yet. I won't stress out until we're at 1,000 and I still haven't gotten my fourth pagoda. Then we're going to be a little concerned. <sighs> Come on, elephant. You can do it. Yes! <laughs> okay. Okay, we're going to stop there real quick, you guys. Let's go check. Oh, yeah, look at this. Look at this. Okay, so 
We did get our four. I now have six. And I just want to check because this is me just being me. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, mm, do I go after a couple of more? Up well, now I need six upgrades. And I know for a fact I'm not going to get six upgrades out of my 3K. But if we peek, I know I posted in here. Let's see, sorry. <laughs> Thinking and making weird noises. Um, somebody had posted that these are the next upcoming. A Centennial Outpost. I could use some of those. Ooh, but Cherry Garden set. I know I have a lot of those in my city. Or in my inventory. Um, we could look at the Cherry Garden set to see what else I would need. Because I know I need some upgrades. Um... Centennial Outpost. I don't know. I know I have some that I haven't even placed in my city yet. Ooh. Okay. I don't know why I went back in there. I think I'm going to hold off over here, you guys, because I know I have enough to lay another pagoda. And I am going to put down a fire, you guys, just so you know. Yes, there's two extra forge points with the earth. But this 10% uh, attack for your attacking army is absolutely where it's at. I mean, that's just fantastic. So I think I'm going to pause because I know I've got some in the other. So let's pop into my other world real quick, you guys. And we'll see how lucky we are in each. 90 forge points. Mmm, yummy. Ooh, if I get 90 forge points in this city, this city is like I'm a baby all over again and I get all excited with forge points. So, yeah, we'll see. And this one I did want to show. I am little, but I did finish. I'm all the way up, caught up. It took me a little bit more time, but you can do it, you guys. Absolutely can do it. Okay, so, like I said, I have less here. Ooh, probably not going to get all six, unless I'm, like, super lucky. But I had to go after this pagoda level one. So, let's... Let's just, we're going to see what happens, you guys. So in this city, I still care, though, about the Mikawa, but I might try to be a little bit more in the middle, but oh, I would rather, because what are the leagues in this? I know I can at least probably make this bronze league. I won't make the silver league here, probably. Mm, probably not. <sighs> So I'm, if I don't make this silver, I'm definitely going to have to get nine times across this pond. Oh, let's go for it, you guys. Let's find out what happens. Yeah. Oh, and we need to exit because I exited FOE helper. Hi, little helper man. Come help me. <laughs> now that we know too, it's pretty, yeah, we're just going to, it's just going to be the way it is. If we don't get the pagoda, it's fine. I would care more about getting this. Yeah, you can see I'm already over here. All right. Hi, little guys. 50. Yes. Oh, my gosh. That's huge. That's huge. <laughs> On my little baby buildings. Oh, that's so good. Okay. 100 medals. Yeah, interesting. 100 medals is really small over here, but that's okay. <laughs> I know I'm in a lower era. All right, let's see. 152. A defender boost. 13. Yeah, if I don't get all of the pagoda, it's fine. Because you know what? Knowing how wonderful FOE is, then they'll have it for next year, and I'll just sit and wait. Because even either way, I'm still getting things that are helping in my city. Like I just got forge points, that was big. In any in metals help too, even the small amounts help for those expansions. So I'm not gonna complain. It's good. It's nice because these are I like oh yes, okay, there's one. Ooh, we need five more. Five more. Okay, don't get your hopes up. It's all good. We're happy with what we get. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> If we play it that way, then maybe they'll give me more. <laughs> My chances will be better. <laughs> Ooh, goods are helpful. But still in this era, too, the previous goods. My previous goods are they're hurting, you guys. Ooh, lots and lots of swans here. 
Okay, let's see. Moving on. Hop, little frog, hop. Ooh, there's a shrine right there. Oh, that's going to be nice. Sorry, I really like the shrine. Shrines are great, especially in a little baby city where you're like, yes, I need them all the time. Store building, 110. Okay. Um, we're going after the 152. Um, 110. 20 goods. 113. It's like what? We've done like one one upgrade for two ish so far. Ish, ishy, smishy, sort of. <laughs> All right, let's see. We want the 50. Sure, we'll just go with the 50. It's fine. I'd rather keep those. Ooh, I'll take some extra army. My army sucks here, you guys. <laughs> Shrine of knowledge, yes. I will take you any day. Yes! Oh my god. Told you elephant was lucky, you guys. Okay, we're at two. We need four more. Oh, four more baby cakes. Four more. <laughs> Term of endearment. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you guys. Five forge points is still nice. I'll take that. 110. 200 medals. 113. Come on, elephant. No. 110. Yeah, I'm getting a lot of medals in a lot of these, you guys, which is fine. And goods. Still need goods. Still need goods. Guys, it's very important that before leveling up to a new era, you have enough goods, especially if you're in a guild that is doing guild battlegrounds. I know it's random, but don't push through eras so fast. Love your era. Sit in it. Relax in it. <laughs> Get lots of goods. You need them. <laughs> oh. Okay, let's see. We're going. We need a 110. Um, 113. Oh, yes! Oh my god, three more. Sorry. Okay. I feel like I'm at, like, some sort of sporting event as I'm watching this. And I'm like, oh, come on. Come on, little frog. You can do this. Give me what I want. <laughs> oh, lord. You're a goober, girl. Okay. Okay, we need three more, you guys, with only 2.3k. Oh. Okay, we're still not going to get stressed yet. We're going to get slightly stressed. Just a little bit stressed. Like I said, though, we're going after how far we get. That's what we care about. So this is more like luck of the draw here, because we're going after wanting to get the bridge. Because we know for a fact that'll be awesome in our city, having 10 forge points. Yes. At this era, low era, yes, 10 forge points is huge. Somebody actually asked me, what is your biggest forge point producer in H? And I said, my forge point bar. <laughs> because right now I have no buildings that give me forge points. Minus, I think, like two shrines that I got. And one of them was just this week from one of the daily chests. It was great. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see here. So now this one we could go with that, but let's go with the um, let's go with the bunny because the bunny is so cute. Hi, bunny. And it was only two. It's fine. Okay, ready? Here we go. Oh no, we're at one point four k, you guys, with only three. <gasps> oh boy. Okay, okay. Oh. Maybe it's not a swan. Maybe it's a duck. <laughs> Sorry. Random thought of the day. <laughs> oh, look at that. I have more forge points over here. This is nice. 
actually, this is going pretty well. Considering I had to spend to get a level 1 and also get some of these upgrades, this is going pretty darn well. I will say that. And I know I'm not even going after the ones with the daily special, so, you know, I'm sure it would be different if you're only after the pagoda and you're not after anything else. So, you know. Then it's fine. Oh, guys. Mmm. We're not going to get even to four, probably. This is fine. This is fine. Then you just have to, like, breathe, shake, and let it go. Breathe, stretch, shake, let it go. Breathe, stretch, shake, let it go. Okay, this one. <laughs> Ugh, color guard. No matter in what era. Ugh, color guard. Okay. Well, we're going to keep pushing, you guys. Use up our 490. <laughs> Not very much. And actually, you know what? We're going to be a little bit more picky, maybe. Let's go after this one. Hi, Benny. Um, okay, so this one is the same for each. So, yeah, I switched to looking at the, the Bogota now, you guys, just because the chances are... Uh, I only have 328. Okay, let's go for the bunny again. Now we're just being a little bit more picky. Okay, so the 12% is the 79. Yeah, you can see I'm not jumping so far. No, you guys. I just want to see, because I know we're still going to get lanterns through the end of the event, so I'm not too stressed. But mm. And now this will be some of our last ones anyway. See if we can't get two out of it and see what happens. Uh, one more. We could do a 110. Mm. You want to push it? as far as we can sure why not all right you guys so we're at three in this city um which is fine like i said <laughs> we go with what we get um but wait five oh no that's that's for the other one silly girl okay so we did get three which isn't bad um i probably let's see even if i get one two three upgrades it puts me at um, no forge points though. I probably won't put it out. Like I said, I'll just save it till next year, which is fine because, you know, I'm small and these are still things that luckily they've been bringing back. So I'm all right with that. And also if we look at the event, um, I will get at least 50, um, so 200 more lanterns each night plus however much you get from each of these quests. So I'll be able to spend some more. Um, and then I will we'll have enough of the, um, upgrades for the bridge, because I am going to get one right here, and I believe I had six, did I have six in my inventory? Oh, girl, boy, you didn't spell any of that right. <laughs> oh, God. Um, I have five, so one, two, three, four, five, I'll get six, so yeah, I'll get one more. Um, by doing, where am I in the pond? I'll have enough lanterns to be able to get to this guy by the end of this pond. So, yeah, I'll get my bridge upgrade to what I need it to be. Um, so that's great. But, yeah, hopefully this was helpful, you guys, just to kind of see the difference. Um, have fun. Go after that Pagoda upgrade if you're going after it today. All right, bye, guys.